Cowboys, Seahawks, as I mentioned, NFL Network, live on sportsbookreview.com. Seahawks 544, the total. When Wilson gets down on Anita call a play, he's telling the huddle what they're going to do here and what they're going to run, but he's also praying. I mean, that offensive line is horrible right now and beat up. It really is. And we've seen it very clearly in the first two preseason games for Seattle. The first-string offense has been able to do a whole lot. And the primary reason for those initial failures for that Seahawks first-string offense has been the inability to protect Russell Wilson or to generate any kind of holes for the running games. Uh, the offensive line coach, Tom Cable, quote, this is uh, a quote from earlier in the week, what day is the first game? September 11th? We have a lot uh, of work to do, and there's a ton uh, of adjustments being made on that Seahawks offensive line, most notably Jamarcus Webb is expected to make his Seahawks game debut this week at right tackle, uh, someone who Seattle signed as a free agent from Oakland uh, this past spring. Uh, who's expected to be a starter for this team. Well, no doubt the big story of the preseason so far is Dak Prescott. He's accounted for six touchdowns and only has five incomplete passes. He's been so good that it looks like the Cowboys are just going to say he's the number two. He's legit. No need to make a trade. <laughs> and look, you know, here's your GM, Jerry Jones, uh, talking about does the fact that Prescott's look good in two preseason games mean that you no longer need an experienced veteran. And Jones, his answer is real simple. Yes, unquestionably. You know, uh, <laughs> uh, what's happening to us is we're able to give these snaps to Prescott, principally because of Romo and where we are with him and his experience. We're able to give these preseason snaps to Dak, and in doing so, we're going to have him maybe as many snaps during this preseason experience, evaluation, all those kind of things, as Romo got in his entire career before he became a starter. And you can't buy that. And I agree with Jones in the one sense that it is these are valuable snaps for Dak, as Dak Prescott. And Prescott got me last week. You know, uh, he, he did. Um, but that being said, there is a real difference between the Rams backups having communication problems in week one and Miami kind of playing a little bit of passionless defense in week two. Now they're traveling to Seattle with the sea bags off a bad loss. And Seattle's backups on defense in the second half? Well, they've allowed a grand total of three points in two games. Let's not forget the Vikings game-winning touchdown last week came on a pick six. Hey, guys, for the full video, go to sbrpicks.com. So we're giving you picks every day, and you're probably making your own as well. Be sure to participate in SBR's weekly Twitter bankroll challenge. Just post your picks on Twitter with at SBR Sports Picks and the hashtag BetSBR before 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every day, Monday through Friday. We'll be betting your picks, and if the bankroll is positive at the end of the week, you could win the profits. Picks must be of events taking place that day and available in at least one of the major sportsbooks shown in our Best Sportsbooks page.